late with this video because I thought I might actually give some thought to the finale. I, however, just kidnapped McKenna, so she's not given much thought. <laughs> but that's all right. Um, so I decided that it wasn't much of a plot-driven episode, mainly because I'm not entirely sure I liked the plot. It was very focused on characters, so we're just going to talk about the characters in the episode. I hope you're cool with that. So, Danny first. What do you think Danny of Danny first. in this episode? Mm -hmm. I don't know, because like, I kind of like Danny, but at the same time I was like, he is a Superman now, so like... Which was, yeah, yeah. I thought that was mainly just a way for him to come back. Yeah. While staying dead. While staying dead, yeah. <laughs> so it's kind of a way to stretch that up. Yeah. And I, um, he had a good speech though. He did have he had a great speech at the end. Yeah. Like, oh, I am a soldiery and speechy. <laughs> I will do this. <laughs> so, yeah. I was a little upset at him in the end because he didn't come back. Um, but I'm not I was too also surprised. Kind of glad, but yeah. he got to come back, so I'm a little conflicted there. Yeah. Yeah, because I think it showed his protectiveness yeah. a lot. Yeah. <laughs> showed he's protective, a soldier, and good at speeches. <laughs> Yay! Yay, speeches! Yay, speeches! Oh, the pretty gear. Oh, yeah, I had to think about who that was for a second. <laughs> Uh, I've watched enough Classic Who that the pretty gear is just fantastic. We should watch more definitely with him. I'll go find okay. some with him. Uh, I thought it was a really good, excellent extra send off for him because since the actor passed away, we've been like hearing a lot of references to him, which has been a little bit sad. And this is like a good sort of final send off, and I thought it represented also like the other people that the doctor has traveled mm -hmm. with because I don't doubt that it's like it can't be just the pretty gear and Danny who like were able to resist. I'm like, yeah. no. All of them that have met the doctor definitely were able to. Yeah. So. I was a little upset that they didn't show any of their companions. I was, I was like, I really expected like Amy and Rory to come back or oh. like. Yeah, I wasn't like, too sure that. about them, but maybe like or some somebody of the else from the, from the yeah. past. But also, it was a good way to save Kate while still giving us a heart attack that she fell on the plane. I know. <laughs> no. I was like, no. Kate, though. <laughs> So, I love seeing Kate in Unit again, and it looked yeah. like they actually kind of knew what was going on. Yeah! So, knew what was going on, they had a plan, and they kind of worked with the Doctor, and they worked together. Yes! Um, Rather, although... Yeah, what they've done in the past, right. they just do what they want, and then... <laughs> They're running around screaming and shooting things until the yeah. Doctor goes, Hang on! Stop! Stop! <laughs> I got this. Yes. Um, yeah. But I'm not entirely sure who somehow made the Doctor President. Yeah. Um, like, A, when did that happen? Like, why? Like, I guess really I understand why. why, but like, why would they need a president? And, I mean, the wording of the choice president, too, I really thought was just referencing the fact that the doctor was president of the Time Lord Council for a while. Yeah. And they were definitely tying a lot of things yeah. into that, but with the master being back and all. So, although they gave him this position of command and he just kind of didn't do anything with it. Like, he sort of was like, what? No, why'd yeah. you do that? And then there was really no need for him to use that command. Yeah. So it just kind of seemed pointless. Actually, my, I was talking to my sister and she was like, how would they do that? That's dangerous. Don't give the doctor that kind of power. That's kind of what I was thinking during the episode. I was like, no, please tell me, please tell me the president's not all mad at this. No, and I was like, oh, really? No, don't do the thing. But Osgood, I loved having her back. Yes. Um, I am kind of sad that she gave up the scarf, but... Yeah. And uh, I was really kind of sad when she died, because well, I was yeah. like, I wanted her to be the next companion. That, and I keep seeing her as, like, a representation of the fans stuck in the series. Yeah. And I loved the fact that she, like, quickly was like, it, Missy, it's it's the master, right? He's your old childhood friend. Yeah. You hate him, but you love him, and you, like really understood that you know yeah. connection because she basically done as much research as most of us have. <laughs> yeah. And then Moffat was like, whoop, no. I was like, oh. Oh, uh, there we go. That's kind of how some of the fans feel, I yeah. guess. <laughs> exactly. I'm like, I'm trying not to see that as representative of him <laughs> dismissing us, but but so <laughs> yeah, that's. Bit annoying. Yeah. Oh, hey, Clara next. Oh, Clara. Um, yeah, what did I have to say about her? Oh, I said it was interesting, like, I remembered at the beginning of the episode how she was, like, trying to act like the doctor. Mm -hmm. And I'm finding it fascinating. This is a little bit of tiny <coughs> bit 
to me that's like, you could have been an English major coming out. <laughs> I'm like, that's, because she's like trying to be more like him, but she's picking up on different key characteristics. Mm -hmm. um, like, she's got the lying. Well, she's not great at the lying, as we see at the end of the episode. But she lies and she talks a lot. Yeah. Although I was confused, some of that talking, like, I'm not sure how much of it she would have gathered from just talking with the doctor. Yeah. But some of it I'm like, so wait, how do you know that? I don't know, I thought she was just rambling. There's a little bit of rambling, but it was all correct. And so then I'm going back to thinking of the fact that like some version of her had jumped into the doctor's timeline and was like there through all of that. Oh yeah, and then I was coming back to blame me. Yeah. Especially with the post-it notes that we never got back to. Oh yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Sort of the main difference between her and the doctor right now is that she lets her emotions get the better of her. Yeah. Like with the last episode when she was chucking the TARDIS game, she's like, nah! <laughs> yeah. And then now she's like, no, you don't hurt Danny, Danny, no! Yeah. So. Any other thoughts? I felt like she was kind of out of character, actually. Like, I can understand that she just lost Danny and then got her back, but at the same time, she'd been so cool when everything else had happened in the past, and all of a sudden she just loses it. Like, I get that she lost someone, but at the same time, right. you should be able to keep some of that cool. Yeah, she was pretty decent in panicky situations before. Yeah. So, doctor. Oh, the doctor. There wasn't too much character development no. with him. Like at the end he's like, oh my gosh, I'm an idiot. And not like a commander of any sort. Really. I mean, I didn't think you were. Yeah. So. I did like how he said it. Yes. I was like, yes, it's coming. It happened. <laughs> it's a thing. It's a thing. So was this Claire's last episode? I don't know. Because the end was really confusing. I was like, are they saying goodbye to good? Like, I mean, it sounded like they were saying goodbye to good, but lying to each other to make it seem like they weren't. Yeah. But it felt like there should have been a little bit something more, so I'm curious what the Christmas episode is going to be. Based on yeah. the fact that Santa sort of comes while he's just chilling out in space in the TARDIS, <laughs> I don't think she's going to be back. Yeah. That just reminds me of Voyage of the Dam, where something happened while he's in space, so whoop, no companion. Mm -hmm. so. Yeah. And the way she left was kind of so I expected yeah. something a bit more awesome. awesome. Yeah. Rather than just lying Powerful. to each other. Right. I am disappointed that it was like, look, maybe we finally get Calibrate. And then no. And then no. Although, we can have Santa now. Maybe Santa knows <laughs> Santa Calibrate. Knows. <laughs> Santa knows all. He says he's been trying to track him down. Yeah. So, who knows? I did, I think I did have like in my notes while I was writing, it's like, can you fit a planet in that bag of yours? <laughs> Because that would be nice. I feel like the whole thing with Santa is going to be similar to him trying to do with Robin Hood, though, because, like, you're not supposed to exist! <laughs> yeah. That, that'd be fun. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. And then, last character, the Master. Oh, I, well, that was a great twist, having the Master be a woman. So much fun. I loved it. I got a Mary Poppins vibe, too. Oh, yeah, she came down with <laughs> the umbrella. She came down with like, the umbrella, and you're just like, what? You have been on Tumblr. <laughs> Seriously, writers. I love, I love how you're back. I know. Uh, yeah. She's definitely not dead. No, no way. She's no staying way. dead. It's the master. It's the master. master's not dead. Master can't die. No, it's never, never, never gonna happen. Never. <laughs> um, much fun. I did like all the references back to their childhood on Gale Fright and how, yeah. how they are. Yeah, they are enemies, but they are but they also friends. friends. Yeah. <laughs> so. I told you to get no frenemies. Yeah. <laughs> like, she's like, are they in middle school now? <laughs> I was like, yes. yes. <laughs> they are middle school teenagers. <laughs> yes. Just 900 year old teenagers. Just 500 year old teenagers. Oh yeah, we're sitting outside St. Paul's because I didn't think of mentioning that at the beginning even though we came all the way here. Just for that purpose. <laughs> Just for that sole purpose. Only it's a little bit louder on the steps of St. Paul's. Oh, they, they added extra steps. So, oh yeah, yeah, in the show. There yeah. are not that many steps. No. I don't understand. I mean, they were. They kind of needed those extra steps. Yeah, they but, did. Uh, whoop steps. 
I don't quite understand how they did the inside of St. Paul's. Is it like in a whole inside, like separate dimension? They just yeah. walked out. Is that what it was? Yeah. Okay. That was sort of how he helped know there was time lord technology. It was like, shoot, I guess it is the master. That's what I shoot. thought. Shoot. <laughs> Theories on the Christmas episode? <laughs> Besides, Besides Santa, Santa having Gallifrey in his back. <laughs> technology, you know, bigger on the inside yeah. and whatnot, and how else is he going to reach all the children in one night? Exactly. So, please tell me Santa's a time Please tell me it's a thing. Please. We don't actually, we haven't actually heard anything about it in the beginning. No. I was just thinking that on the way over here, actually. I was like, if this is Clara's last episode, which I'm assuming it is, then who is the next yeah. companion? I really wish it was us. Yeah. Good. <laughs> so much fun. <laughs> She'd be, she'd be like Donna again, where like, she just had her like, nope, I know what's going on. Yeah. <laughs> you don't. Shut up. <laughs> yes. That are like, I would love moments where she like, lost her inhaler, and the doctor's like, frantically scrambling to find it. <laughs> like, no, wait! <laughs> that could be good. <laughs> Especially with this constant running. Hang on, I can't! <laughs> I can't <laughs> breathe! Fine. We'll face the problem. <laughs> You know that would happen. She'd be like, why can't we just face him now? <laughs> yeah. I know you got skills. I can't run like this. Maybe yeah. I have to just deal with Running's it. not gonna happen. You know karate. Go. Go. <laughs> or, or just inevitably, how about just duck into this room? We don't need to keep running. You're this just, is an empty room right here. Just hide right here. I was bad at ending videos. It's like I'm on that next 